Hello everyone and welcome to an, another short guide with me who's uh, and yes we do have Microsoft uh, Microsoft Flight Simulator in front of us once again and uh, three things that will make your um, flight easier and that's flying third person if you if you want to learn how to fly a uh, third person you, you you can do it with one simple trick you this is tip number one here is the end key. Ah, that's pretty simple. But last time we did use ins. This is a more like the cinema mode. But if you want to fly a third person, use the end key instead. If you, this doesn't work, what you can do, move your mouse up here, go to camera, and here you can switch manually between cockpit, external, and also showcase camera. And here you can also uh, adjust the zoom levels. So yeah, that's tip number one. For tip number two, uh, we are going to talk about the weather. This is a beautiful weather, sunshine and everything. But if you want to make it more dramatic or more beautiful, go with your mouse up here and move yourself here weather and here we can adjust we can make it november december and also we can add a wind okay it's uh, windy and uh, yeah don't do that we will crash <laughs> but you can also adjust like uh, what time of the day so you can do these beautiful flights in third person and it's amazing it's incredible how beautiful this game is so tip number two adjust the weather it makes your flight experience so much better and for my third tip is is actually custom destination don't choose an airport just pick whatever start location you want on the map and to make these custom destinations you can see here we have uh, the beautiful map and uh, we did actually be flying uh, around in this area is you just have to press down like this and set as departure you don't have to go and fly to an airport you can actually start uh, wherever you want so for example let's uh, press here set departure and fly we are Request flight follow random uh, uh, custom departure mid-air no start or anything and now when you know how to adjust the weather, you can just make a beautiful, beautiful setting. Or super dark. Like flying above a city can be super beautiful in the middle of the night. So with this three small tips, I hope you will have a fantastic a flight next and yeah if you're more sadistic you can always make chaos make a storm for yourself see how good you are handling a storm and you can also just pick storm here and now try to survive this my name is Fusa and I am happy that you have watched one more guide from me and if you want more guides from a wide amount of games feel free to subscribe to the channel and let me know down in the comments what you want to see next more microsoft flight simulator crusader kings you name it let me know thank you and have a fantastic day toodles